What is going on guys? Coach Joe here at the Lion's Den, located in Colmar, PA, and this video is exactly what it's titled. Just giving you an update on where things are at my bicep. So, after the initial injury had occurred, I saw orthopedic care when I was in North Carolina, uh, and then I had to basically follow up with my doctor uh, back home because it happened out of state. Now, kind of the issue with, you know, uh, injuries, et cetera, is insurance. So, uh, with my insurance, it made me go through a hospital. Now, the hospital I went through is a very big hospital, and uh, basically their appointments were backed up for a while, okay? So, you know, instead of kind of just not doing anything, uh, while I had time before my, you know, initial evaluation of the injury, where to go forward, I have been training around my bicep, doing things that didn't cause it pain and just doing the best that I could. And you guys are gonna see all those videos uh, you know, coming up in the future, right? Surprisingly enough, a lot of things didn't bother my bicep at all. I was able to do most things, and my philosophy behind this is to just get as much blood flow around uh, the injury as possible, work around it as best I can to still keep the gains that I have made over the last several months, and then whatever has to happen, has to happen, and hopefully I've done the best kind of homework I could do uh, before that. So. In my mind, I really believed it was a partial tear. And when I initially talked to the orthopedic when I was in North Carolina, he had thought the same thing, uh, but it didn't make sense for me to get the MRI there because it was gonna take a couple days and I had to get back home. So, two weeks go by, finally get the MRI. Here, it is a full-blown uh, distal bicep tear. And honestly, I was shocked, right? Like, literally, the, the tendon is attached from the bone. Uh, and I was just surprised with how much I was able to do. Uh, however, with that being the case, they want surgery ASAP. So, uh, surgery is scheduled immediately, right, for me to get that repaired, uh, and then I start the recovery process. Now, how long will that be? I don't know, uh, but with me being who I am and doing good homework, I'm uh, you know, being very, very optimistic that I'll be back ASAP, uh, better and stronger than ever. Uh, so. You know, I just wanted to update you guys with where things are at because I, I did think it was a partial tear. It is a full distal bicep tear. Uh, so I will be laying low with the bicep work for a little bit of time, but as soon as I can get back to it, I'll be back training hard. Uh, in the meantime, I've stockpiled a ton of content for you guys to watch, and I will be uh, you know, catching back up with you guys as the recovery process uh, post-op is going down. Now, I do want to say, guys, that this was kind of, you know, a freak thing out of the blue. I've been training for such a long time. So for this to be my first kind of training injury, honestly, it, it, to me, it's like, you know, it could be way worse. Uh, so I just do ask that you guys keep your negative comments to yourself. Okay, I've heard them all. I don't need to hear them anymore. And if you have positive things to say, you know, and are wishing me well, that means the absolute world to me. And all we're going to do is focus on moving forward and getting better and getting stronger and healthy. So... That's the update. I hope you guys enjoy all the videos that are going to be coming out in the future, you know, in the collaborations that I got in uh, before I had the surgery. There's going to be some great ones, and I will catch up with you guys soon. So stay a lean, mean track machine. Okay, guys, no matter what life throws at you, be a lion and go attack it head first. Be on the offense and always live your life to your fullest uh, with a positive uh, mindset and attitude. And uh, peace.